Hey guys, so Patreon is a tiny bit late this month because they hold my money until the 10th, which is always a lot of fun. But anyway, we're gonna do fat packs. I guess we can do Bobby's first. And so good luck, Bobby. Obviously we are looking for Averson. So this will be Bobby's fat pack. It's got like, I think these are new. I haven't noticed these recently. Um, do all of them have them? Yeah, it looks like all of them have it. So good luck, Bobby. Hopefully you pulled at Avacyn. We do have a few more fat packs left. I'm giving Dan two fat packs, Oaf and Shadows, and then two play mats, which haven't come yet. So hopefully they come. Uh, they're actually mini play mats, so we're gonna raffle off this play mat, but the play mats I'm gonna send to Dan this month are mini play, play mats, and I wish like they came this. It's just this whole month was a bit like. Nothing came in time. Patreon would have held the money again. Just a mess. Anyway, good luck, Bobby. Let's see. Hopefully, I can get this video up. So today is a Wednesday. No, today is a Tuesday. Hopefully, I can get this up Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, it, it might work out. <laughs> it might work. So good luck, Bobby. Let's see. Looks like it's right here. Let's take a look. I'm looking on camera. Angelic Purge, which is actually being played right now. Filia. I hope they make a new- Oh, also my Liliana playmat is taking over a month. So, yeah. Uh, but I'm very excited to get the new Lily playmat. Ooh, this card is... So... Uh, not the best card to begin with. I believe this is the intro. This is the intro pack for green. But yeah, the Liliana playmat is going steadily. Uh, it's probably a month into it already. Uh, maybe a month in a few weeks. Uh, it looks like it's going to be a good playmat. Eve Scavenger. Pretty much it's Averson or Bust. Um, there's some other good cards, Forgotten Creation and Duskwatcher Recruiter, and a foil, no, not a foil, a rare flip, Guider Reach Bandit. This card is actually worth a few dollars. This card is worth more than most rares, I believe. Yes, it is the flip that reduces casting costs. So actually not a bad pack, because that uncommon for the most part. I mean, it, the pack probably made back its value from the two rares and the you know, common, but that's definitely a very good uncommon to get. Chasm, Tooth Collector, Murder Act, Devil's Playground. This is a very good uncommon too. And a Constable. So I think this uncommon is going to spike soon. So if you have foil copies of that, it's probably not the worst. I do like it a lot. It reminds me a lot of Delver of Secrets, and Delver of Secrets is definitely a good card for it to remind you of. Catalog. I kind of just want Ponder back again. I think Ponder would be good. Pick the Brain. I believe this card is seeing maybe some play. Airy Interlude. And nada. So, <laughs> most valuable card isn't uncommon. That's okay. We the thing with fat packs, you could get a fat pack without mythic, a mythic, and I've done that many times. But you cannot get a box without a mythic or two. I think two mythics box. This card's pretty good. Dread Knight or Cursed Witch. Ooh, there you go. There's West Vale Abbey. So obviously this card is seeing play all over the place. And it's probably a card that bailed this uh, fat pack out because it's not, I mean, we have four packs left. I don't want to say our flip cards have been pretty good. And that's the good part about fat packs is the variants both can be helpful and unhelpful. So oops, Bobby is doing pretty well. I mean, the best, West Vale Abbey is probably the best you can get in five packs. It's not bad, and it's like an extra card. Although we got a lot of intro packs. 
I forgot this card was even in the set. It's very good, but I don't know. It's not being played. So yeah, this is a this is a really good fat pack. I believe this card is still worth over ten dollars. And yeah, so two very good back to back. I, this used to be twenty. I think it's fallen off in price. This used to be ten. I don't know what it is right now. So between those two ass packs, not bad. We still have three packs left. So good luck, Bobby. I mean, the decoration stones definitely. I think it's modern playable. It's good enough. Oh, Invocation, Aberrant. Oh, and then like, wow, we got a lot of, the flip cards really bailed Bobby out because uh, this card's not even bad as a flip, but it's, so we got the Militant Captain. Is this the Human Lord? It is the Human Lord. Uh, if you control four more, no, yeah. Is it the Human Lord? Oh no, you get a white, a black. This is not the one I'm thinking about. I think Balia Lieutenant is the one. But anyway, two, uh, wow, not bad. <laughs> Out of uh, seven packs, half the packs had rare or value, well actually no. So we had this rare, we had this as a flip, we had Westvale Abbey and we had Captain and we also had the, the more valuable one, Dusquatch Recruiter. So it's been pretty good. Definitely been bailed out by the flip card. Oh, that's our one mythic. Oh, well, wow, it's, it's a very interesting, it's a low probability, but we haven't hit on anything uh, too good. This I, lo I like Village Messenger a lot. It's probably one of the better flip cards, in my opinion. It will be. So we end up, we end with an Avacyn and see what happens. Not bad. The flip cards have definitely been very good. West Vale. Two rare flips. The most valuable uncommon flip. That uncommon flip is very good. Dusk Watch Recruiter. Trail Evidence, Magnifying Glass. Ah, oh, well, I mean, let's take a look. We got a, so the first few packs are bad. I think it's not bad, Decoration of Stone. Decoration of Stone, Westvale Abbey is obviously very good. And then the one mythic. <laughs> anyway, that's it. Bye, guys.